what is the energy and the classification of energy so energy is the ability to do any kind of work in the ancient age muscular power was considered as the source of internal energy men were used for doing the every kind of work which is done by machine today from the lifting of ant to the lifting of the elephant so comparison of weight purpose so energy is stored in many forms such as the potential energy of stored in water chemical transformation heat light and the gaseous form like energy is available in everywhere every every like of particles every kind of particles so what is the classification of energy the primary or secondary source of energy second conventional or non conventional energy third renewable or non renewable source of energy it is the based on the reusability of energy sources fourth the commercialization basis and the fifth the low and high grade energy so what is the primary sources and secondary sources here we are talking about the primary sources the energy source extracted from the stock of natural energy sources is known as the primary source like if we extracted a coal from the earth crust it is considered as a primary source without any kind of transformation so second point this type of sources has not undergoes any type of transformation or convergence just is extracted from the available resources is known as primary sources only the separation and the cleaning done for the extraction uh, usable separation and cleaning for extraction purpose and the coal crude oil natural gas solar power and nuclear power are the main example of the primary sources and what is the secondary secondary sources the sources obtained from the primary sources are known as the secondary sources with use of the conversion and transformation processes from the primary sources of energy like uh, electricity uh, electricity generation or produced from the using using of the coal like a boiler mechanism in a thermal power plant from the water using of the water from the hydro power plant like tidal and nuclear type of energy sources where the similarly extraction of the petroleum such as the petrol diesel and lpg are also able to heat generate or power generate heat generation purpose like if we consider a uh, uh, petrol and uh, diesel are also usable in the vehicle so it is a kind of second resources where the primary sources it is just uh, extraction from the natural available sources without any kind of procedures while the second resources is known as the extraction from the primary sources with some kind of activities so of uh, transformation and conversion so we can easily use that energy for our domestic or uh, general purpose and uh, the second type of uh, energy sources are renewable sources and non renewable sources the if we are talking about the renewable sources the primary energy obtained from the constantly available sources of energy which is constantly available like a uh, punah prapya urja stroth so like a uh, solar and wind energy it is available in the uh, abundant uh, process like natural resources which can replenish after the use of available resources which can also we can get after the use of that particular sources which is known as renewable sources here we are talking about the non renewable sources the primary energy come from the finite stock of resources of energy which is considered as a non renewable sources after the one use of that energy or energy sources we cannot further use we cannot uh, get that particular sources which is known as non renewable sources coal and crude oil after the uh, use of the coal we cannot generate it easily it takes a million years for generating that type of resources like coal and crude oil uh, petrol diesel while the solar and wind energy it is available in natural sources so we can easily 
uh, use after the use of uh, it where the resources which cannot replenish after the use of that natural resources are also known as non renewable sources firewood is considered as a renewable as well as non renewable sources while if the rate of the use of firewood is less than the its growth rate it is it will be known as the non renewable energy sources while the, if sufficient amount of trees are grown then it can be treated as a renewable sources of energy so it is based on the growth rate of the trees as and uh, commercial sources and non commercial sources if the uh, the sources available in the market for certain price for general public it is considered as a commercial sources like electricity lignite coal oil and natural gas like lpg and cng is available in nowadays for our uh, vehicle uh, use of vehicle purpose electricity pgvc a reliance which provide electricity as a predefined rate is known as the commercial sources we paid them for our uh, usable electricity bill and cng lpg gases are also known as the commercial sources while the non commercial sources the not available it is not available in the market for a price so like a firewood solar energy and agriculture waste are used for households it is not available provided by any particular company for public use but we somehow manage to use these sources for domestic purpose but it is not available in our uh, like uh, it is not available easily available in by uh, any in uh, particular industry or companies somehow we can manage it for our domestic purpose use of domestic purpose these are also known as the traditional fuels non commercial sources like of uh, uh, firewood and solar energy then the low grade energy and the high grade energy low grade energy it is cannot convertible easily and completely in the other form like a coal a 30% of energy can converted into electricity but remaining 70% it converted into form of heat so it is basically loss of our energy also it is are uh, uh, available in cheaper rate so we are here we are talking about the higher grade energy it is can con it can convertible easily and completely in the other form like electrical energy it can easily converted into heater it uh, use of uh, heater battery charging and in air conditioning it is easily convertible so it can known as a high grade energy where it is the expensive due to the this type of characteristic because it is uh, totally convertible into one form to other form of energy so it is known as high grade energy okay